Hi, welcome to this how-to video from Catalator.com. Today we're going to go through how to make a laser cut box pattern using Makeacase.com. Okay, we're going to start off on at Makeacase.com and put in the dimensions of the size of the box we would like in order to get some patterns to go laser cut with. We're going to start off by choosing our units that we're going to work in, either inches or millimeters. And then we enter in the width, height, and depth of the box. So I'm going to start with a box that's six inches wide, three inches high, and four inches deep. And you can get an idea of the proportions of the box. Make sure you've entered in the correct dimensions. You can also say whether the dimensions are inside or outside. You would select inside for those dimensions if there was a particular interior volume that you were wanting to achieve with your box. I'm going to select outside. And then you can also select the thickness of the wood that you are using to make your box. Finally, you can uh, select the type of joints. So we can either do flat joints if we're going to glue the box together, finger joints, or T-joints if you want to bolt the box together. So I'm going to select finger joints, and then I can um, play with the tab width. I can use larger tabs or smaller tabs, depending on the aesthetic look that I would like for the box. Once I've set these up, I can generate the laser cutter case plans, and this will give me the six sides of the box. I will finally finish up by entering in a kerf of 0.0025 which is half the beam width of the laser that we use at Catalator Makerspace. With that said, I will download the plans and I will have an SVG file that I can use to start getting my box uh, into CorelDRAW. Okay, so we start off in CorelDRAW and we are going to make a new document choose the defaults of 24 inches wide by 18 inches high to match the bed of our laser. Select OK, and then that starts up a blank document template. We're now going to import the case plans file that we just downloaded from makeacase.com and select somewhere in the top left-hand corner of our document. We can zoom in a little bit. And we go to the Object Manager. We want to right-click where it says CasePlans.svg, and we want to ungroup all objects. This is going to give us now six separate curves, one for each side of the box. We can select all of the curves, go to Object Properties, and then change the line thickness to hairline and the color to red, RGB red so that we are ready to go cut those outlines um, on the laser. We can decorate the box at this stage by putting on some text. Or we can go and add other geometric um, holes and uh, other shapes and things like that to the various sides of the box. At this stage, you can save your file and get ready to go laser cut it. Thanks for watching and I hope you found this video useful. You can find out more information about what we do at our Facebook page, on our Instagram feed and our Pinterest page. There's lots of cool pictures and interesting projects for you to see there. Thanks and see you soon.